Kyle Tucker, Jess Jardins, and Giordano short and second respectively. First pitch swinging, little comebacker over the mound. Jess Jardins has it, swipes the bag for one, on to first in time. A six to six to three inning ending double play. That one was gonna end up foul of the pole down the left field stripe. Swing and a miss, he struck him out with hands in. Benny is 0 for two today. First pitch, line in the left field, sinking quickly, and it is off the glove of the left fielder, Seabird. Scoring on the play is O'Connor. Now heading for second is Serrano, he's in on a slide. We are in the seventh, but he's greeted with a long, loud double by Muller. Next pitch, line drive, caught! Snap throw to second, in time, a double play! Oh, as pretty as you please! Ben Irwin catching that line drive right at him. The seventh inning. There goes the runner, Des Jardins. Not a great jump. The throw down, short hop, and no tag applied. It skips under the glove of DeRosa. Slide Stealing a little bit to his right. The pitch swung on, hit out to right field. Back goes Muller, still going back. This one is one hop over the wall. It's a ground rule double. It'll score two for the Purple Eagle. Five, three, Bobcats lead it. Still nobody out in the ninth. Dawson Bailey in second. The 1-0 to Marquesa. Swung on off the end of the bat, sinking quickly into center field. Here comes McGuire. He will make the running catch. Tagging, heading for home, and scoring without a throw is Bailey. Palmer with good speed out at second. Would seem like he'd score for sure on a base hit to the outfield. There go the runners. The payoff pitch inside, ball four. Ward tosses the bat away. It is a bases loaded walk and a 5-5 game. Here is Spencer. Purple Eagles, watch the next pitch be lined out to right. This is deep, going back, and it is going to drop for a walk-off. Ground rule double. The Purple Eagles score five in the bottom of the ninth to win it. Oh, Spencer Marcus got that one up in the jet stream.